Good morning and welcome to Norris Dog Training Company. We're here with Barry and Raven and we're going to demonstrate all the commands that Raven's learned here at school. We'll first start off by introducing the training equipment. Barry's got a standard six foot web training leash. Keeps the majority of that leash in his right hand which leaves his left hand free to make a correction on the training collar and the correction is a simple tug and release. Now the training collar is the second piece of equipment that we're using and we'll show you how to properly put that on Raven when he goes home tomorrow. We're going to start off with healing, which is properly walking on a leash, and the command is Raven Heal. Now Raven's been taught to walk on your left hand side, which is where all of our obedience training takes place. I notice Barry constantly encourages him. Now incorporated into the heel is an automatic sit. So whenever you stop moving your feet to cross the street or talk to a friend or a neighbor, Raven's been trained to automatically sit and wait for that next command. Nice automatic sit. And another nice automatic sit. Now the next commands we're going to demonstrate for you is a stay command. It's a hand and a voice command and Barry uses the flat of his left hand and the one word firm command to stay. Now with a puppy like Raven, start off with your sit stays lasting about one minute long and work your way up to about three minutes. Now it will be important that you practice these commands inside your home because we don't want Raven just to associate obedience training and good manners with just being on leash. Now Barry walks all the way around Raven for an added distraction and he held that stay very nicely. And he keeps him interested, he keeps praising him. Another nice automatic sit. And we don't use food for, for motivation, we use praise. Another nice automatic sit. Stay. Again, Barry uses the flat of his left hand and the one word firm command to stay. That's our recall or the come command. And he's been trained to come right back to you and when he reaches you, he sits which is nice so he's not coming back and jumping on you. And then Barry gets him back to healing. Raven's done really, really well with the training. Another nice automatic sit. Now the next commands we're going to demonstrate for you are the down commands. It's a, it's a hand and a voice command and it's going to be the one word firm command to down. Now we have a lot of distractions going on right now. People cleaning leaves up and dogs barking behind us. They aren't our dogs, but they are our neighbors. But this is good because we want Raven to be able to respond to these commands with distractions. Now you see he broke that command. Barry goes right back to it and gave him the down command again. Told him to stay. Now your down stays are going to last a little bit longer than your sit stays. Start off at about two or three minutes and work your way up to five. Again, practicing all these inside your home as well. Now Barry returns back to Raven, walks around his left hand side and gets back to his right. So Raven's on his left and I'll heal him out of that. Good, another nice automatic sit. Barry puts him into another down. And again, you want Raven seated first before you give him any command. So Barry waited until he was seated and then gave him the down command. Raven, come to the boy. Come on, Raven. Good, Barry uses the leash to kind of guide him back and you see that he sits automatically once he reached Barry. Another nice automatic set, very nice. Now the last command we'll demonstrate for you is going to be our down from a distance. Stay. Barry gives him the one word firm command to stay. And from here he'll use his right hand and the one word firm command to down. 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 Stay. And you heard since he didn't do it right away Barry said no which is a, just the verbal correction we use and then gave him that down command again. 
Raven's done such a remarkably good job for such a young puppy. We want to thank you so much for using Noir's Dog Training Company as your personal dog trainer. And please keep us posted if you have any questions or concerns in the future. Thanks again, and we'll see you soon.